I've spotted the wild puppet Tweety. We've got him on our radar. Yo, 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 what's going on, Team Tweety? I hope you're all super well. I'm currently in like the waiting area for my flight from Dubai to Sydney. This one goes for about 14 or 15 hours. It's an absolute killer. The eight hour one wasn't too bad. Now I got a massive flight ahead. I'm about to get on that flight. It's leaving in exactly, I'll tell you. Oh, well, that was a bit anticlimactic. I thought it was gonna be like 20 minutes, but it's actually over like an hour and a half. Sick. So just gonna chill here. Not too much, I'm pretty hungry. And there's no vending machine, so that's peak. Anyway, I'll catch you guys on the plane. Yo, I'm so tired. I'm literally halfway through this journey. My first seat was horrible. I had done to another seat. Now to see that one now, the seat doesn't go back. And uh, I just want to sleep, but I can't. My goodness, this is a track, this journey. Getting the longer one done first is definitely so much easier. Because when you do the short one, then the long one, the long one just feels like forever. I'm not enjoying myself, I just have a pizza. I chucked that down the goal. Now I'm waiting for breakfast, which will be in like three hours, but I need to somehow sleep. I guess just lay there, close my eyes, and go. Look how tired I am. Oh well. Catch you guys in Sydney. I wish I could just transport and teleport like you guys do. For me, I have to actually wait the six and a half hours, whereas you guys just have to wait a couple seconds. We've done it. We've made it back to Oz. Now we gotta go find Dart. We got G'day. Welcome home, mate. Okay, it's gonna be somewhere here. There's a lot of people looking at me. Nah, I don't see him. I don't see him. I've spotted the wild puppet Tweety. We've got him on our radar. Perfect, Tweety. I'm good, mate. How are you going? You happy to see me? I'm delighted to see you. Do you have the car? Or are we yeah, walking? Ah. Where is he? There he is! Spencer! Who's that? You don't even know who I am anymore. Hey! Hey! I think he does. Hello! Hello! Hello. Look, Hello. everyone's here. Welcome home. Hey, Spencer. You look pretty good after 24 hours. Thank or you. It is. Yeah, you look... it's been a while. <laughs> it's been a while, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hi. Oh, yeah. You've got a bit of a hello bark, huh? Yeah. Wow, it feels weird to be home. <laughs> Does it feel like home? <laughs> no, not really. <laughs> My room. Oh, God, this feels real weird. Like... This is my room. For all you OG viewers, like, oh, this is a mad throwback. For all you new viewers, this is basically where I lived for ages and now, wow, this is crazy. It doesn't even feel real, like. Oh, and I actually got a good bed. This is great. I'm loving it. So, Dad, where are you taking me? I'm taking you down to the dungeon. Oh my goodness. So I asked Dad, I have a ton of football gear, but I'm not sure if the coach who well, was... Well, there's a fair bit there. The coach who was doing work for me might have taken it, so I want to see what I have. I'm hoping I have the orange balls, which looks like... Orange balls. Those, orange. those are the most important balls. ones. I don't know how good they are. Yeah, that's orange like... Balls. So They're there's still a little bit of stuff nets. missing, yeah. Enough to run a session. Yeah, well, for myself, that's what I'm most concerned about, oh, because right. these are the best, and I have, like, one, two, three, seven of them. So that's perfect. Much but better than just for one. one-on-one -on -one coaching, there's enough stuff there to do it. Yeah, exactly. Bang! Claire, what did we cook up? Take us through it. Well, you have some lamb steak there. Yeah some stir-fried cabbage and a leek. Yeah. And this is a stir-fry... Um, asparagus. Asparagus, asparagus yeah. with a honey... I remember this one. With a honey and mustard and cream sauce. Yum. And then and the brown, brown rice. rice. Why? Brown rice. Why brown rice rather than white beef. rice? Why? Oh, that's a nice tweety subject. Oh! <laughs> well, thank you for that, Claire. It's a pleasure. First home-cooked meal. Well, pleasure, mate. I always cook home meals, but it's not the same, is it? <laughs> It always tastes better when somebody else cooks it. True. Now, do you guys remember maybe, well, 24 hours ago when I was packing my bag in a mad fret to make sure that I had 30 kilos, 7 kilos, the laptop bag? Yeah, now i got to unpack it. 
how much fun. Like I put so much work and time into making sure everything was right just to unpack it again. Like, sick. So yeah, this is great fun. But I did actually manage to get this roller over, which I'm stoked about. It was something I wasn't sure whether I was going to be able to. But now that I've got this here, this is great for me. You guys know I love this roller. It's a lot firmer than just a normal foam roller. You've got the plastic and then these bumps are actually quite firm as well. Stoked to be able to bring that one over. Now I've completely finished cleaning up my room. Got the boots under there. And I actually had some chocolate milk because it's Australian. Anyway, it feels so weird to be back, like, home. It doesn't even feel right calling it home because I haven't been here for eight months. I would call that place I was staying at in Crawley home. Now, I hope you guys can understand this is a bit of a different video. I've just been traveling so much, it's really taken it out of me. But a couple of things I want to discuss. Firstly, I want to make a video about what I learned about the whole experience in the UK and how it helped me in my goal to becoming a professional footballer. And if it didn't help me, I think that can be really interesting. It creates a learning curve for you guys when you go over. And you guys can also see my opinion on what the whole experience was like. Now, on top of that, I have some other news about the team I'm playing for in Sydney and then how I'm going to approach some other teams. So that should be interesting. I don't want to get into that today. I asked Dad if he wanted to vlog before so that we could discuss it because he knows a lot more than I do he's been the one that's in contact with the coach almost like an agent agent Papa Tweety pulling the strings like a boss so yeah those are the two videos that I really 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 want to make and I want to get them out to you guys as soon as possible so tomorrow's one will probably be talking about where I'm playing and how I'm going to approach this eight weeks in Australia and then sometime soon, I'll be talking about my experience in the UK. I'm exhausted, I need sleep, I need to go to bed. Hopefully my sleeping pattern isn't too bad, considering it's only like 11 o'clock now and I'm getting into bed, that's like perfect timing. If I can just sleep till like eight o'clock in the morning, then I'll be pretty happy. But anyway, 10.20, I'm signing out. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe if you're not here. Join the journey, I'll see you tomorrow's video. Bye. Listen, listen.